Hi, welcome to the monthly reading for April. This is going to be additional messages for our life and our soul and our spirit. Um, going into April, I'm doing this reading because it's going to be a really transformational month. I feel that things are going to start appearing right in front of you, right when you need it. You're going to be moved to another place. Your life is going to change and we're going to be going forward. We're doing a lot of closures. It's been coming up in readings over and over and over again. We're actually coming more into our personal power to make choices and decisions and leave a lot behind us and finally put it to bed. Whether it's people, projects, situations, whatever that has almost, you know, reached its expiration date, you might have been holding on to it. It's kind of like going through, I'm getting the image of going through your refrigerator and doing a clean out of all the food that's turning colors that you didn't even realize was sitting in the back of your refrigerator. We're doing that. We're purging. We're letting go of a lot. You've already started this process and now we're welcoming in this new energy in April and it's going to be exciting. It's going to be new. It's going to be transformational. Your life is going to be changing because you've put to bed so many things. It's new openings are opening up. So I wanted to use these two decks. These are two decks created with spirit, free spirit decks. I'll put the information below, but I wanted to do the natural oracle for life first for our life or uh, what we can look out for in the month of April. What's it going to feel like? What are the messages for us, for our life, mind, body, spirit? This is kind of like a, oops, a hybrid tarot oracle. So we're going to get messages about what our life is going to feel like. <laughs> it's going to be moving and shaking. There's going to be a lot of movement. See how the camera's going? We're going to be having a lot going on. There's a lot coming in, a lot happening. There's going to be movement here. I can see already. But um, this is going to be, this is a natural tarot oracle. So we're going to get um, what our life's going to feel like, what's going to be coming in messages for our mind, body, and spirit along the way. What is April going to feel like? This is my special deck. And then I'll pull messages from spirit. What loved ones who have passed on, what do they want to say to us, our spirit guides, as we go through this month of April. That's going to be a new energy. We're feeling a new energy, and it's going to have, our life is going to have a new energy because of it what we're being pushed to do, what we're being pushed to let go of, where we're pushed to move forward. Um, I have the chill because uh, lots of things are going to be occurring in April for all of us. So let's see what the messages are. Okay, here we go. Let's see what falls out of the deck. What are we going to feel like? And, ooh, oh my gosh, I, ooh, I knew they wanted to say something. I feel like maybe I should, ooh, ooh, gosh. Wow, we have a lot of angels around us. I'm telling, oh my gosh, this is divine. Okay, I have to, I have to go in the order. Wow, wow, oh my God. This is amazing. Oh my gosh, there's no room for everything. Oh my, wow, I have the chills for all of us, honestly, because the feeling of April is, following your heart this is this literally see this light of um of our heart here it says follow your heart know you're walking along a love path now follow your heart and let it light up further and lead the way we're becoming with all these closures that we have we're coming more true to ourselves and following our core what we divinely love in our lives what we are divinely led to do and it's following your heart following your divine real passions Follow your heart through your life right now, tuning in more into your inner heart, really um, paying honor to that and follow your own heart, follow your own path this month of April, know you're walking on a love path now, follow your heart, literally follow your heart and it will light up the rest of the way. So take that step, whatever you're divinely led to do, driven to do, what's ever in line with the deep inner workings of your soul and your heart. Take the first step because it will start lining up the way. Like even if you don't even know where it's leading to or going, just 
follow your heart and your innate passions this month of April because it's divine and you're being led on purpose somewhere. So definitely do that and look at these two healing angels. Oh my gosh. So let's do the first angel praying angel. Here's all prayers. You know, any prayers you have are being listened to and will be answered. You are heard. Anything you've been hoping for, or praying for, help, needing help from the divine with, they're coming through for you. Know that everything that you hope for and desire and think about and are striving for, they're with you. They hear you. And um, anything that you're silently saying to yourself in your mind and your heart, they're with you. And they're hearing your prayers and things that you could be praying for could be coming in in April, literally. Um, your prayers that you, things you've been hoping for could be coming through this month of April and to remain faithful and trustful as you follow your heart. And here we have Angel of Healing. And Angel of Healing is here to help remove anything that is causing hurt or pain. She will help to heal your body, mind, and spirit of all that needs to go. Anything that's been painful, anything within your body, within your life, within your soul, anything. We're, we've been releasing a lot. Um, anything that's been hurting you physically, emotionally, mentally is being released here. Um, you have angel of healing power coming in, meaning that they're helping to clear the way and remove anything that's been causing you pain in your head and heart. And this could have been a lot to do with all those closings that we've been doing, whether it was with people, circumstances, uh, situations up till now, you're letting that go. You're becoming more following your heart. Um, and Angel of Healing is here to help remove all these blockages, anything that was causing any hurt or pain in your body, mind, and spirit, anything that needed to go and release. This is so powerful. These two angels came out. I can't tell you. And then we have the Shining Star, which means that everything that you've been working on is working out. It's divinely led right now as you follow your heart. Shining Star, this is a star for a job well done. You're on the right track and shining bright. All the stars are aligned. You're making great progress. Well done. They're applauding your efforts. Um, whatever you've been going for, the stars are aligning. It's like a new cycle is coming in here. So definitely follow your heart because... This is divine. You got two angels coming out here. There's been a lot of healing going on here. Your prayers are being answered. Your efforts are being rewarded. So keep going on that path of whatever you're doing. Oops, and look at this. The camera's rocking here. There's a lot of movements with this, a lot of movements. And um, here we have follow the signs, follow the signs, look out for love prints to follow as they will show up along the way. So you might actually be getting signs from the divine, from your angels, loved ones who have passed on. Things might be, like I started the video saying things will be showing up in your life all of a sudden to validate you're on the right path. You're you're following the right love print. You're, um, you're going to stay open to these signs that you might get from spirit seriously and also physically in your life material-wise. Like things can be showing up right when you need it through people, through objects, through things coming in. The next step showing up all of a sudden now. Things are opening up, clearing the way. Um, so follow those signs all the way through April because it's right here. The angels, it's like it's definitely coming in and there's movement here. You're supposed to follow these love signs all through April. Keep it moving and follow those love signs. It's divine. Let's see if we, should we get any more? Let's see if they, uh, oh, ooh, yeah, okay. I knew they wanted more. Oh my gosh, and look at this. It's harvest time. I'm telling you, we're between the star and harvest time. Look at this. It is harvest time. You have worked so hard, and now a much-deserved harvest is now coming from your efforts. And we have the star card here. You're a shining star. There's harvest time. Whatever you've been working on, there's going to be payoffs in the month of April. You're going to have tangible rewards for your efforts. You're going to have physical rewards for your efforts. It's like a harvest time. You've worked really hard, and the harvest is coming in. This almost looks like a shape of a heart. It's from doing things that you love, that you're passionate about. It's fiery. Anything you've been working on, um, it's harvest time. You've worked really hard, and it's all coming in. You've been divinely um, doing what you're meant to do and following your heart and it, it's this is the shift we're going to see things coming in here definitely um lots of rewards and good things coming in from things that we've worked so hard from and keep doing that keep doing that um i think that might be it let me i might let's see if we have any more cards from here but i feel like these were the ones that urgently flew out of the deck 
and it's interesting the deck kind of dies down in energy um so this is excellent let's pull some now i'm going to use some um pure love from spirit and this is going to be from anybody who is passed on that you love dearly your spirit guides angels um what do they want to say Ooh, oh my gosh what do they want to say for us look at this we are here for you and they certainly are because we have angel of healing here angel the praying angel we're here for you they're giving showing you signs they're so for, here for us in April for this is a really opportune time. Something's happening in April where a lot of things are coming to fruition. You've done so much work. Their stars are aligned now. You're following your heart and um, they're here for you. They're here for you. They're going to be showing you signs um, in April that they are here for you. Um, I almost want to smile so big from this card and almost want to cry at the same time. It's interesting these cards make you smile and want to tear up at the same time because you feel it in your soul. You know that to be true. They're really here for you in the month of April. Um, it's a definite harvest time and your efforts are being rewarded and they're very happy about it. That's when I feel like they're smiling too and it's so loving. They're... Um, Definitely could be showing you signs. Is there anything else that you want to say? Ooh. We know all you think. Yep. They know all you think. And that also underscores praying angel. You know, anything you're holding in your mind that you're going for that you don't even speak out loud to people. That you're just privately going for, privately thinking about, privately, whatever. They, they hear you. And that's what this card was. This, I have to bring it up again. They're just saying, um, praying angel. This card says, praying angel hears all prayers. Know any prayers you have are being listened to and will be answered. You are heard. And this is saying, we know all you think. This is just underscoring that they're hear, they hear you. They hear you. They know. And even if you don't share it with people around you, everything that's going on in your head, they're here for you and they know everything. They know it. They they know what you're thinking. They know they know everything. And they're here for you. I could almost cry. <laughs> so do know that. You're not alone um, at all. Um, okay, let's see what other, if there's another. I feel like there's one more message. Ooh, yeah, okay. Oh my God, oh my God, we will help you through changes. Didn't I start this reading saying, this is a transformational month. There's a lot going on. There's a lot of closures. I could almost cry like how on point this is. We're purging a lot, we're letting go of a lot. We're letting go of a lot of situations we've been very comfortable with. Whether it's work-wise, projects, relationships, anything. We're transforming. This has been coming up again and again and again. We're supposed to welcome in the new. Things are changing, we're changing, our life is changing, we're getting more in line with our core. We've healed so much. And because of that, it ripples out into our life and our life starts changing too, to reflect the work that we've done. You know how it came up, Magician in the Mirror? All the changes that we do with inside, it starts reflecting back to us. And it could be a little, um, you know, change can be a little unnerving. It's um, whatever. They're helping us through the changes. They're helping us. We are here for you. We know all you think. And we will help you through the changes. So this is a really powerful month of April. And I think that's why I was guided to pull these cards again, just to show they're there for you. They're showing you signs. They hear you. They're releasing things that were causing any hurt, pain, blockages, all of that. They're shining on you, on your efforts. There's harvest, things coming in in April for sure. And follow those love prints that you see. Um, it could show up in the physical. Things could be showing up through people, through things suddenly appearing that you needed, that you desired. Um, and there's a definite harvest coming in. So definitely rewards for physical hard work, anything you've been working on. Um, they're shining star on your efforts. So keep going in April and um, they're helping you through these changes. So whatever you're releasing, closing, moving on from, welcome in the new now, follow those signs. You're right to do that. They know all you think, they're there for you. They're helping you through the changes 
and bravo to you for following your heart through those changes too, I want to say, and continue to follow your heart. Okay, so that's my message for all the messages for April. Have a fabulous month of April and uh, check out my channel for other readings. Bye-bye.